Hi, and welcome to Gadget News and Review. We are home to some of the coolest gadgets, and the best consumer reviews online, buyers guides and features. If you like our review please subscribe for more upcoming reviews videos. Google Wi-Fi System Review Google Wi-Fi is the easiest and most manageable router that we've ever set up, period. It might not be the most powerful or offer precise controls, but it more than makes up for any lack of depth and unmatched simplicity. The age of the traditional wireless router has come to an end, slowly getting replaced by wireless mesh routers like the Google Wi-Fi. Devices like the Netgear Orbi and Samsung Connect Home are extremely popular these days, so it shouldn't be too surprising that Google has jumped on the bandwagon with the Google Wi-Fi. Google's wireless router undertaking has paid off. Not only is Google Wi-Fi the best wireless mesh router money can buy, but it's also one of the best routers today. This is mostly thanks to the fact that it packs in more mesh units at a lower price than competing mesh routers. This attention to value is combined with simple setup and great network management through a clean mobile app. Trust us, after using the Google Wi-Fi, you won't want to use any other wireless router. Google doesn't only have an advantage in pricing on its hands, but it also has the best designed Wi-Fi units and the easiest setup of any offering. Each Google Wi-Fi unit, a small and simple cylinder with a white LED band in its center, is capable of the same functionality. This means that any Google Wi-Fi unit can function as the core router of the system, while the others can spread wired internet, which is beamed to the unit wirelessly, with their included Ethernet ports as well as wireless internet. All three units are powered through USB-C. Setup is also totally smooth, just like the Google Wi-Fi's hardware design, using a free iOS or Android app to facilitate the entire process. We're not going to dive into the nitty-gritty of the procedure, but the Google Wi-Fi app will configure your network by first scanning the QR codes on the Wi-Fi point connected to your modem or gateway. The app will then ask you to give your new network a name and set a password, then pair any additional Wi-Fi points you have by scanning their QR codes, you'll then be able to label individual nodes in the app. Again, this only takes a moment for the initial Google Wi-Fi node to recognize additional nodes and for them to start working. You're not going to get the same depth of access as even Netgear Orbi provides, so no band switching for you. However, Google Wi-Fi does handle this in behind the scenes automatically. The Google Wi-Fi app does boast more useful settings, like constant monitoring of your network, its points and the devices connected to it. The app has an included internet speed test, like Ookla's mesh test that measures the health of your points connections, along with a Wi-Fi test that measures your connection strength from within the network. This is the most complete and elegant suite of controls we've seen on a Wi-Fi mesh system so far, despite its lack of drop-down boxes and toggles. Additionally, you can prioritize bandwidth to one device for a time, control smart home devices and pause internet access to certain devices in a family setting, all from within this app. And, now Google has expanded Google Wi-Fi's network check feature to test multiple devices, so that you can spot potential bottlenecks in your network, as well as rearrange your Google Wi-Fi access points in order to optimize network performance. The Google Wi-Fi is able to match, if not surpass, Netgear Orbi's performance. Drawing the absolute most out of our 100 megabits per second Wi-Fi service, we've never seen any router be able to do the same. However, the core difference here is that Google Wi-Fi can deliver this high performance in every room of our, albeit small, house. We are able to stream 4K video through Netflix to our Roku Premiere in the basement, as well as play Overwatch in the office where the modem is located without issues. Wi-Fi mesh systems like the Google Wi-Fi aren't focused so much on throughput as their coverage, but this product definitely delivers. The traffic prioritization feature can ensure that your gaming session is getting more of that crucial bandwidth than the other devices in your house that are used mostly for Facebooking and streaming HD videos. 
Plus, the network can automatically repair itself should one or more of the Wi-Fi points be accidentally unplugged or otherwise lose power. While we know that Google Wi-Fi operates its mesh system over existing Wi-Fi bands 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz over the 802.11s mesh protocol rather than Netgear Orbi's tri-band system that communicates over a second 5 GHz Wi-Fi band, we haven't found a massive difference between either's performance. We do see slightly faster download speeds in megabyte per second on the 2.4 GHz band from the Orbi over the Google Wi-Fi, but that could also be an anomaly. Where the Google Wi-Fi truly excels over comparable routers is simple, the fantastic price to coverage ratio. You can get equal coverage from competing systems with fewer units, sure, but the versatility of having more units gives you, just in terms of eliminating dead spots, is huge. Final verdict The Google Wi-Fi is the most straightforward router we've ever set up, bar none. And, that's even taking the two extra devices required to complete it into consideration. For a relatively low price point, there are more units on offer than most of Google's competitors, not to mention, the best setup and management app by far. For all the finer hardware controls it lacks, and the lack of AC3000 or AC2200 throughput, Google considered every toggle and test it could present in an easily understandable way through its app. There's even bandwidth priority control. Couple that with a minimalist hardware design that's easier to hide in plain sight than any we've seen yet, and you're looking at one of the best Wi-Fi systems that money can buy today.